Nikki Coleman. When she was a little girl, she had big dreams. She wanted to learn how to fly. <laughs> a plane, that is. When Bessie grew up, there were no women who were pilots because not many schools taught girls how to fly. But that didn't stop Bessie. She found a special school all the way in France that would teach her. When she finished to brave Bessie, that's what her friends called her, was the first African-American woman to become an airplane pilot. Brave Bessie's big dreams really took flight. Meet Alexa Kennedy. When she was a little girl, she had big dreams. She wanted to be a doctor, a brain surgeon to be exact, so she could help people's brains when they were sick. Alexa Kennedy studied really hard, and when she grew up, she became the first African-American woman ever to become a brain surgeon. Dr. Kennedy was a children's brain surgeon who loved making her patients feel better. Sometimes they even drew her pictures just to say thank you. Kudos to Dr. Kennedy, who really used her noggin. Meet Susan Lori Parks. When she was a little girl, she visited lots of libraries, read tons of books, and wrote oodles of stories because she wanted to be a writer. When Susan Lori grew up, she'd read her stories out loud and act like all the different people she made up, just like actors do in a play. So she wrote more and more stories. Once, she even wrote a story every day for a whole year. Pretty soon, people were acting them out on street corners and stages.